Good evening. A man has died after he was tasered by police in an East Perth car park. Officers say they were trying to help him when he became aggressive and a struggle erupted. An internal inquiry is now underway. One fluoro police vest remained in the car park, the evidence left behind. Police say they were responding to a robbery at the office works in East Perth around 11.30 this morning when they came across a man needing urgent medical assistance outside. It was Stephen and Susan Lewis who alerted officers. He actually seemed way out of it. I said, you know, I don't want to be standing too close because he's way out of it more than alcohol, like banging his head constantly on the wall and I said, and, it, and the police said, is he doing anything else? I said, no, I'm not going to find out. Police say the man became aggressive, a struggle broke out and an officer was injured, causing a taser to be deployed. As officers continued trying to restrain the man, he became unresponsive, police providing first aid until paramedics arrived. The man later died at Royal Perth Hospital. Office work staff left the store late this afternoon after being questioned by police for hours. Nine News has been told it wasn't the man who was wanted for the robbery. Instead, it was two women. But when police arrived, they found the man in a state of delirium and he charged at them. He'd also been coming and going from a nearby store, acting erratically. And the police major crime squad has just left the scene. Renee Henry, it's trying to piece together exactly what happened. Yes, Tim, the crime scene was cleared not long ago, but the investigation is very much ongoing. And because it was a death in police presence, there's also a, an investigation being carried out by the Police Internal Affairs Unit. An autopsy will most likely be carried out as well to determine exactly how the man died. And investigators will work out whether officers acted appropriately. Emmy? Renee, thank you.